hello guys welcome to another video of the forex lecture series now in this video we want to look at basic concepts in trading the first thing we want to take a look at is position now in trading every trade you enter is called a position trading is all about looking for a profitable position to take you get into that position hoping for profits you hold the position to see what happens and you exit the position either when it makes some profit or when it has lost as much as you're willing to risk. If you enter into a buy trade hoping the market will go up and the market starts to go down, you have a limit to, to the risk you're willing to take. If it loses $100 from your portfolio, you might want to end it there. But if you can take loss of a thousand dollars is up to you and if it goes up in your favor and it reaches your target maybe your target is a hundred dollars you can leave that position pocket your profits but if your target is more you can wait till it gets there or when you decide that the market is no longer moving up you can take out your profits there now in forex you have two kinds of position you have the buy position and the sell position the buy can also be called the long. The sell is also called the short. Now, a trader, a trader will buy if he believes the currency pair value will increase. And he will sell if he believes the currency pair value will decrease. After buying a pair, a trader has to wait for hours, days or weeks or even months for the price to change favorably for him to take profits. Or for the losses to be too much and the trader decides he doesn't want any more losses. The waiting time depends on your strategy. If you have a strategy that is long term, you can say my waiting period is two weeks. If it's short term, you can say my waiting period is one hour. Depends on you and whatever you decide. The, the system... Or the process by which traders look for positions to enter is called analysis you have to analyze the market you have to analyze the market to know if you want to buy or you want to sell and there are two kinds of analysis you have the technical analysis I have the fundamental analysis the technical analysis involves the use of mathematical models like average like the moving average the moving average is simply the average of the price over a period like for example you have over a 10 day period you can see the average of the euro usd was 1.2 1.225 that's the average over a 10 day period for the euro usd and you want to buy whenever price goes above that average and you want to sell whenever price goes below that average that's technical analysis now these values are plotted by your platform you don't have to take out a book and begin to write out your formula and what you are looking for many of these models are already available by default for the fundamental analysis which is the second type of analysis this is less common the technical analysis is a lot more common fundamental analysis is less common but it's said to be the most effective fundamental analysis involves the use of economic factors like interest rates like unemployment rates like the non-farm payroll these news releases and other economic tools economic events that influence a country's economy also influences the value of their currency and when you look at the america for example and say oh the unemployment rate is five percent higher than it was before this is a bad sign the usd is going to fall you can go down and you sell the usd hoping it will have a negative change and give the euro usd a lesser value and you can take your profit there or if the euro the the, the european economy is overall negative bad bad employment high unemployment rate and a lot of other problems that affect countries and continents 
you can go on and sell the euro usd and say oh the usd is stronger fundamentally so the pair is going down and you get your profit now thank you for watching this video i hope you enjoyed it if you have any question leave it in the question sec section and if you're on youtube please subscribe to my channel i'll make more of these thank you